If you would have looked at me in my old life, you wouldn't have thought anything good. If you hadn't stopped me outside the abortion clinic, I wouldn't have had that little Samson. Here in Texas, major abortion laws are dominating the news cycle. 13 clinics were forced to close, leaving just eight in all of Texas. The eyes of the world are on the border town. From that side, the abortion clinic. Over here, the anti-abortion clinic. Only a fence physically separates the two institutions. Now that I have Jesus in my life, I feel like I have a purpose. Hi, good morning. I'm a clinic escort at the Women's Health. We have some protesters. I started providing clinic defense when the protesters started amping up their tactics. We're all just praying for you. You're going to regret walking in there. Keep the peace, OK? What keeps us going is that this is what the patients have to face. And they should not face this alone. I'm Catholic. I pray every day before I come here. <laughs> Ever since I started working here, the church turned you away. My conscience is clean with him. People seek abortions for a multitude of reasons. El doctor le dice que no puede perder al niño, se puede morir. I know what that desperation feels like. I just wasn't strong enough to have an abortion at 19. I turn to God. I always turn to God. Oh, he's making me doubt my beliefs. I can't shake the feeling that something really bad's going to go down. 911, what's your emergency? They attacked me. We're all very angry, which is good because it's anger that gets things changing. Estamos luchando por salud, dignidad y justicia para todas las mujeres. Everything that we're doing it really is life and death. That's what we're fighting for.